What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video we are going to be discussing the 2025 model year Porsche 911. This model year 911 is going to be called the 992.2 version and it's going to be bringing some new changes. We expect to see slight design differences on this vehicle but the biggest change is going to be the powertrain. We expect to see some hybrid engines for the first time ever on a 911 and I'm going to be covering all of that in today's video so stay tuned. Starting off with the design of this vehicle. Overall design wise we don't expect to see really any changes at all. This is because the Porsche 911 is a vehicle that Porsche likes to keep almost the exact same same throughout the years and throughout all the decades that it has been being made. They just make very minor changes. We expect to see some super slight differences in the vents and the grills of the vehicle up front as well as the lights and the same thing with the rear of the vehicle. When it comes to the interior of the vehicle, we don't expect too many changes just like the exterior. However, this time around we do expect to see a fully digital gauge cluster on the 911 very similar to what we have on the Porsche Taycan. And now discussing the biggest change on this vehicle which is obviously the powertrains. So for the base models of the 992.2 version of the Porsche 911, we expect them to keep a very similar powertrain throughout all the models just with slight increases in horsepower and overall feel of the vehicle. For example, the current 911 Turbo is powered by the twin turbocharged 3.8 liter flat 6 which makes 572 horsepower. We expect this model to be bumped up to about 600. But the most shocking thing is that a hybrid powertrain is being developed which is is most likely going to be used on the range topping 911 Turbo S. This car may be called something along the lines of a 911 Turbo SE hybrid and we're expecting the 911 Turbo S to have the same 640 horsepower from the engine which it makes right now but this time it's going to be powered with 120 to 130 horsepower electric battery so we're expecting close to 800 horsepower around 750 to 770 somewhere around that range. And that concludes all of the information that I have on this 2025 Porsche 911. Let me know if you guys are liking this vehicle or if you're not liking this vehicle. Thank you guys so much for watching and as always have a great day.